Hello, and welcome back to the Sweet Boys Play the Ocarina of Time. We are picking up where we left off, and we are on our way into the next mini dungeon. <gasps> Did that just blow your mind or what? <laughs> How'd you know that was there? I bet you didn't know. Uh, how did I know it was there? It had nothing to do with me looking up a guide. Nothing okay. to do with it at all. Okay, that's good. For a minute, I thought you weren't being genuine. I totally just remember all of this from my childhood. I remember this whole game, pretty much. That's good. It's so easy. It's so easy to remember everything and where to go and what to do. So we're pretty much only here for one item. What is that, then? I don't know if I... Uh, well, I'm not going to tell you. What, do you think I'm going to spoil the game for you? Why would I ever do that? <laughs> I want to know. Uh, I don't want to do the work. I just want to be rewarded. Well, you're not doing any work. You're just sitting there. You're hardly even paying attention half the time. <laughs> left, up, right. Left, up, right. Okay, I think that I am doing this right. I believe mm. I come here. I play Zelda's Lullaby. And then it makes the thing happy. Yeah, yeah. And then it drains the water. And then do I go And then you jump there? in the water. I don't think I was supposed to come down here. Break the pot. Oh, I can climb, thank God. Yeah. Okay, now I need to... Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we're not going that way. That thing doesn't look very, very cool. Not doesn't very cash very money. Cash money. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> oh, man. Great minds think alike. Hey, Jared. It's like Link Phillips. Jared, have you ever uh, worked somewhere where you kind of felt like you needed to be... Uh, oh, no. I need a key. Have you ever worked somewhere where, where you felt like you kind of needed to filter yourself around like a lot of your coworkers? Yeah, like every you, job I've ever had. Oh, yeah? S really? Yeah. yeah. Damn. I was just thinking that like, like earlier today because I... Uh, I, oh my god, don't suck me. I um, I was at work, and I was uh, filling up the salad wall. And on the salad wall, we have these little buttons where, where you could, uh, you could like, pull out these shelves that the salads are on, and it makes it a lot easier to, like, fill them up and rotate them and, and whatnot. Uh -huh. And uh, one of the e-cart girls was walking around. E-cart is like, you know, people order groceries online, and they shop them for them and whatnot. All that yeah. fun stuff. Like DoorDash, Buffer Groceries. Yeah, yeah one of the e-cart girls came around, and um, she saw me filling up the salads, and she was like, oh, my God, I had no idea those pulled out. And the whole time, like, in my head, I'm just telling myself, don't make a pull-out joke. Just don't don't <laughs> make a pull-out joke. Just whatever, please. And all the thoughts in my head were like, make a pull-out joke. Make a pull-out joke. Like, say something about, about pulling yeah. out and, and, and say, like, oh, you think that's cool about pulling pulling out? And I'm like, don't do it. Don't. It's not appropriate. This is a workplace situation. <laughs> you don't even know her. You don't even know this girl. And you can't make a joke about pulling out. And I'm, I'm, I'm sitting... Oh, my God. I'm petrified. First, I was afraid. I was petrified. Can I go in here? There was a mummy Oop. right in front of me when I'm trying to get this heart. But yeah, anyway, so so she was like, I didn't know that it, that that pulled out, and so I'm sitting there for about 30 seconds, dead silent, just having this debate in my head, and it's so stupid because like all that time filtering myself, and then finally what comes out is something along the lines of, yeah. So then I just can't make any conversation <laughs> at all. Like I can't, I can't just be a normal person because I have these yeah. sick thoughts in my head that I have to bury <laughs> deep down and like not let out. And so I just look like a weirdo. I'm like, yeah. Oh my god. Whoa, we found a cool little spot. Yeah. See, that whole story would have been really funny if at the end, after fighting it for so long, you still make a pullout joke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like you say it way late. She's like, "What do you, you think that that pull out is cool?" <laughs> you say it like at like ten minutes after she she said that. You're like, "Cause you were talking about <laughs> uh, you were uh, those things you didn't know they could pull out and uh, um, yeah." So I'll make it a joke off of that. Yeah, I love it. At the very end, I just make the joke anyway. <laughs> Can I see your manager? I'm gonna get you fired right now. You can't fire me. I'm sick. Yeah, the stuff I've always had to filter is. I've, I've worked, like, blue-collar stuff a lot, so, like, 
cussing and making dirty jokes and stuff, that's always been a thing. But, like, the politics is what I always feel. I just never get into it. It's so annoying. I just stay out of all of it. Yeah, I 100. Eh, excuse me. I 110% agree. Uh, when it comes to politics, I remain as impartial as humanly possible. Have you ever gone into an argument that involved, like, politics or no? Um, I mean, like, I, I'm sure I have. I can't really name anything off the top of my head. Uh, I, I just, I just hate when I, like, I, when I feel like people are being ignorant, you know? Like, ignorance is something that, that frustrates me, and it has nothing to do with politics. It's just, it's just ignorance in general. For sure. Um, I mean, like, sure, sometimes it happens to have something to do with politics, but, like... Yeah, it's it's not even really political opinion for me. It, it's just pure ignorance that frustrates me, and that is the only yeah. thing that I will like argue with. Everybody can have their political opinion. Uh, I really don't care. I will be a hundred percent honest. I I do not care. Like, I I don't know, man. It's, it's just who I am. I'm sorry, you know, my my priorities be different than than yeah, some right. people. You just be you just be different. You're just yeah. built different. I'm just built different, I guess. And uh, to be honest, I I'm happy. I'm happy just the way I am. And uh, you got you got sweaty little hands. You got you got my little hands. You got big big badonka donk. Big old uh, yeah, I got trunk. a big old booty. You got a big, I got old a big dump butt back there. Yeah, you're built different. It's just you know, it's just jeans. You you lost the jean lottery, and you know what? It's okay. Wait, what do you mean I lost? <laughs> the, I, I'm happy the way I am. <laughs> what do you mean I lost? What are you trying to say? Come on, it you're doesn't matter, dude. You said you're happy. Yeah, but what are you? You're not happy with me, apparently. <laughs> What's up with this floor vagina? What do I do? Can put I blow it up? Put a put a bomb. It's it's got to open. Yeah. Ooh. I thought you said you knew what you had to do. I thought I did. I have no you idea what I have to do. You just guides and you just are reading the the guide for a different game. Are you just reading like What the f what the hell is this? A bomb chew. Okay, that doesn't sound healthy. Yeah, the thing is like I, I read a guide but I skimmed around really really quickly cuz I, I just there's a lot of optional stuff in a lot of these places and I didn't I don't care about the optional stuff. I I just yeah, I I, I want to know what to do. In order to to get in and get out. Yeah, I'm very. I have I have no way of helping you, bro. Yeah, well, I mean, what's new? Because you did you did the one thing that you said you knew you had to do, and then it didn't do anything for you. So now what? <laughs> well, I think it did. I think that this is. I think oh. I finally figured out where I gotta go. Okay. Uh, <laughs> e emptying the water, I believe, allowed me to go down here. I think I fight. Let's go, Tua. You gotta strike fear into its heart. It's pretty scared. You can tell it because it keeps out. turning around. <laughs> it doesn't even want to look at me. It's like, ah, I want to look over here now. <laughs> like, oh my god, this guy's freaking me out, man. He keeps teabagging the floor. I'm definitely going the right way. I'm pretty sure these hands are supposed to tickle my nuts, I think. Those are scary, dude. Ooh, ooh that's not my nuts. Ooh. Oh, oh god. Excuse me, uh, but my uh, my my nuts are down there. Oh my god! It's so oh, creepy. Oh my god! Yeah, Get it's away. horrifying, right? Oh my god! That is I actually creepy. don't really know how to fight this guy. It's oh, there you go. You. I scared him. Oh. Okay, I think I just I really got to avoid the hands, or maybe I need. Hands. I think I need one of the hands to grab me in order to like get him to come out and attack me. I just gotta remember to get away from the hand quickly. Can you cut? You could cut the hand off, maybe. Can you? I don't know. I can't. I can't get out of the hand. <laughs> the hands really got. Oh you. my god! Come here, you ugly bastard! Wow, that is a freaky character they made. Yeah, I hate him. I don't like him at all. Uh oh. Thank you for knocking me loose. Appreciate that, brother. I was about to say you should wait for him to get back into the into the the ground before you get out. Let me go. The way he like let waddles go, towards go. me, it's oh, so that's discomforting. So freaky. 
Uh-huh. We got you. He sure did. But now I got him. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah, come here. Okay. Catch these hands, come on. man. Baby, come back. Put your head down in my face. I'ma <laughs> slice you, and then I'ma dice you. My little boy, Link Sword. Yeah, we did it. Whoopee, hooray. What's in the chest? Look how big the chest is compared to Little Link. I know. It's huge. Go, 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 go. What's in the chest? What's in the toy box? Do we got little baby keys? Oh, we found a lens of truth. Set it to C and press C to look through it. Mysterious things are hidden everywhere. Be sure to try to use it outside of the well. Seeing the truth will cost magic power. So press C again to stop using it. Okay. That's what we came for. We got what we came for, baby. We got what we came for. And now we're gonna go... Back outside. We got what we came for, now we just gotta escape. We gotta escape this place with our lives. Wait a minute, dude. I, I think I might have a life hack here. I think. Let's see. Let's I think see. that maybe I can, uh. Maybe I can teleport out using the prelude of light. Which is up, right, up, right, left, up. Of course. Up, right, up, up, right, up, right, up left, right, up. left, down. Easy mode. I can practically do this in my sleep. Oh! Dude, I just remembered this. I gotta share something crazy with you. Yes. What? So, I believe I told you that uh, our old friend Anthony was in California a, a little bit ago and was visiting. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, he told me about this, uh, like, rock festival or, like, like rock concert thing that was going down in uh, West Virginia. And uh, it's like uh, three or four days long, and there's a bunch of different rock bands playing. And uh, this takes place in September, okay? Yeah. So, one of the days is September 11th, okay? Okay. <laughs> you following? You, you know that's where good, the story's that's a good going? Day. That's a good yeah, day, yeah. You, yeah, it's a, yeah. It's Lots a good of day. good memories on that day. <laughs> okay, um, so... Uh, I allow me to list off some of the bands that are playing in Virginia at uh, the Blue Ridge Rock Festival on 9-11. Okay? Okay. Megadeth. <laughs> okay. Theory of a Dead Man. <laughs> Who else? It gets better. <laughs> Body count. <laughs> uh, You're making this up. I swear to God, I have the list right here. I can send it to you <laughs> as proof. It is an actual rock like venue. Okay. Body count. We're okay. we're 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 almost halfway there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wage war. <laughs> In flames. <laughs> it gets better. Uh, oh no! Escape the fate. Ah! Uh, you now you ready? Yeah, I'm ready, ready. For the last one I have for you. Oh no! All that remains. Ah! Uh. <laughs> oh, actually, actually now now that I see, there's actually one in tiny lettering. Uh, brand of brand of sacrifice. Jesus. I thought you were going to say, like, Jefferson Airplane. <laughs> oh, no. What? Can you imagine a rock band named Jefferson Airplane that played at a rock show on 9-11? That, you, you would have to be doing that consciously. Yeah. Yeah, yeah dude. I, I don't know if, like, the people that set it up, if they did that, like, on purpose, thinking it'd be funny, but... <laughs> We, like when he told me I didn't believe now there are other bands that are playing that day like I didn't name off all the bands I just named off the ones that are like okay seriously like Their these are the ones are, playing yeah. on 9-11 yeah. but, the, but the ones that I listed were about like 75% of the bands that are playing that day yeah 
That's insane. I love that. That's I don't love that, but that's that's yeah. Crazy. Woo, <laughs> easy choice of words. Choice of bad. We don't want to get words. canceled. Just like, just like my adjectives. We don't want to get. We don't want to get canceled for for speaking humorously about a tragedy that happened over twenty years ago. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> We're going to get canceled. We don't want people to be like, oh, how dare you? <laughs> um, They're going to bury yeah. us alive. And uh, just the one thing to wrap it up, I just got to say Bush did 9-11. Thanks, Anthony. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, thanks, Anthony, for making us this way. <laughs> but, uh, oh, yeah, boy. the bands that are playing then are, is uh, quite a horrible coincidence. And you know what that means. That means it's um the be the begin no the end of the episode. Very good, Jerry. It's the end Damn. of the episode. The beginning yeah. was at the start of the episode. Yeah. You're learning. No. Well, before we wrap it learn. up, do you have any? Yeah, you don't. I don't learn. I don't. I didn't learn anything today. Yeah, it's like the it's like the saying goes: you learn something new every day, <laughs> but then you say, no, you don't. <laughs> Wait, what do you wait? What do you mean? No, you don't. Well, I didn't learn anything yesterday. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, uh, before we wrap up the episode, do you have any uh, concerns, questions, remarks? I'm concerned for that rock festival, and that's all I have to say. Yeah, I'm concerned for the fallen um, and all that remains. Um, <laughs> yes. Jesus. All right. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today, you guys. So tomorrow uh, we should be starting a brand new dungeon. I hope you're all looking forward to that. I know I am. And that's all we got. So thank, thank you uh, so much for watching. And we will see you in tomorrow's episode. Peace and love. See you later, everybody.